back to my channel. My name is Brenda and for today's video I'm going to be showing you guys four different ways that you can style your coffee table for fall. So hopefully you guys do enjoy today's video and you get some inspiration for your own home. If you are new here don't forget to hit the subscribe button so you don't miss out on any future videos and let's go ahead and hop right into it. So here is the blank slate of the living room and this is our formal living room So I do have another one and this one we don't really hang out in very much I do at night when the kids are sleeping So this one's a little bit more on the formal side Obviously the couch isn't like facing the tv or anything But this is basically the setup that I have and then I do know that i'm going to get a lot of questions on the coffee table So I will leave a link to my blog where I diy this I turned it into basically like a vintage table using easy off So I will leave that link down below for you guys but anyways we're gonna start off with the art of home book from shay mcgee which just came out and i placed that on the coffee table and then right next to it i added my absolute favorite confit pot that i purchased from olive atelier and then for the stems for this one i'm gonna be using these beautiful kind of like i don't know like berry stems almost and um these are actually spray painted i will leave a link to that tutorial down below as well and i basically just added those in there and then right next to it, I added this beautiful like scalloped bowl and then I added some leaves from outside. And yes, I look like a crazy person trying to find as many leaves as I could because we do live in California and it's not entirely fall yet. So I tried to find as many leaves as I could. These are all really tiny, but it ended up working out. Then right next to it, I added the Live Beautiful book and then this Paris book that I thrifted. And then right on top, I just added two candle holders and these I purchased at Hobby Lobby. And they do have three different heights and they are gorgeous. So this is the first look. I am absolutely obsessed with it. I love it so much. I think the leaves in the bowl just really added that touch of fall, which I'm obsessed with. And anyways, definitely let me know how you guys like this one. And you will be seeing this bowl in some other of the styling in this video because I'm just obsessed with the way it looks. So moving on to the second one, I decided that I wanted this little like match striker holder to sit right in the middle of the coffee table. So I added that in there. That is from Creative Co-op on Amazon. So I'll link that below as well. But I left the books and then I just added this gorgeous rice jar that I purchased at, I think it's called the Junk the junk something it's like they travel around the united states but anyways i just added these gorgeous stems that i also purchased online and then right next to it i wanted to do a little bit more styling so i added this cute little tray with some sage and then right next to it a little magnifying glass and then on the other coffee table books i just added this pumpkin candle that i got from target And then of course, as I said, I'm obsessed with this bowl with the leaves, so I went ahead and added that as well. And here is the look for this one. It's a little bit more on the warmer side, which I love. It just has a bit of pop of color. The leaves and the faux stems really like tie itself together because they're like on opposite sides and they have very similar colors. And I just love it so much. It's a little bit more practical because you have access to the candle or like the matches and you can light your candle, you can light the sage. It's like all within hand's reach. So another version that you can do for this styling is to add just bare faux branches or you can even do real ones. There's tons of different shops that you can find them from. Hobby Lobby has like real branches. You could forge them from outside if you already have bare branches. But I just got these that I had from Michaels from last year. And what I really love about this concept is basically just kind of like giving it a very like almost fall to winter transition and kind of vibe and it's like the leaves fell off the branch and now they ended up in the bowl if that makes sense so I really love like that concept and I think it just looks very beautiful it might not be the perfect one for fall but I think it's the best styling for a fall to winter transition I will say this one is my favorite one so far Thank you. 
Now moving on to the next one. So of course I still left the Art of Home book on there. I really love it and it's the perfect styling book and I also want to keep it pretty open just because it's a book that I want to keep reading. So I just have it very accessible. And then I moved the, scooted the books over and I added this beautiful glass pumpkin that I found at Home Goods last year. And I'll try and link a similar one for you guys as well. And then next to it, I added this marble tray from Target and then my match holder and this gorgeous antique like candle holder that I found at the thrift store. And then for the pot, I decided to do this warmer toned one from Hobby Lobby. Really love the way it looks. And then I also added some of these like coasters or like marble coasters. And also just adds to that practicality of being able to have accessible things for cups and all that good stuff. But anyways, for the stems, I decided that I wanted to do these gorgeous, I think they're called ivy grape branches from a floral. These were sent to me by them, um, I believe like a month and a half ago. And I wanted to use these for styling for today's video. So anyways, I really love these. They are coming off a little bit warmer on camera than they are in person. But if you're someone that really likes the greens, then this is the perfect branch for you. I love how wispy they are. And here is the final look for the last version of the coffee table styling. Definitely let me know which one you guys like. I personally will say that I love the one with the bare branches. That one's my absolute favorite and also the first one. But anyways, definitely comment down below which one you guys like the best. and that is it for today's video so i really hope you guys enjoyed definitely let me know which one was your favorite and once again if you are new here don't forget to hit that subscribe button so you don't miss out on any future videos there's gonna be a lot more fall content coming out here soon very excited as you guys know fall is like my favorite season for like all things cozy and there's a plane flying by so i'm so sorry if you guys hear that but i have some very very exciting like fall videos that are not just decor there's food related stuff as well and drinks and all that good stuff that you guys know i love doing so anyways if you guys are excited as i am make sure you're subscribed Make sure you turn on that notification button, the little bell, so you don't miss out on any future videos so you know when they go up. And also follow me on Instagram. I post a lot of stuff over there and I've been doing really badly of transferring my reels over to here on YouTube shorts, but I'm trying my best. I keep forgetting and I don't want to neglect you guys, so I will try to upload my shorts over here more often. But anyways, if you guys want more inspiration, more behind the scenes and all that good stuff, definitely make sure you go to my Instagram because that is where a lot of the magic happens. So anyways, thank you guys so much for watching and I will see you in the next one. Bye guys.